Hello, Sam Dedif here, Business Development Manager for Copters in Public Safety and Defence. And today we are going to take a look at the Sky Hero Loki 2, which is a fully GPS denied internal tactical drone. So what we've got in front of us here is the Loki 2, uh, the internal drone, uh, and we've got the controller system for the drone as well. Now in its current iteration, the controller here will power up to four drones at any one time, which is why we have not one, but two of the Loki 2 drones in front of us today in the pack. So this can be operated all within one controller, up to four drones at any one time, and as the name suggests, they're built to be used internally in GPS denied environments. And that means there's some really cool features the drone has to make it work in those areas. So firstly, as you can see from the cage design, the drone is entirely collision tolerant. So it can be crashed into walls, damaged, picked up, thrown around, and it will still operate perfectly fine. One of the features that allows it to do that is something that Sky Hero call turtle mode. So if the drone crashes and flips onto its, uh, onto its side or upside down, it can then be inverted using the controller flips back over into place, and then you can carry on operating. So after a big crash, the drone can be put back right, and then you can carry on flying. As well as that, you've got a range of sensors, which mean it can fly completely GPS denied and still hold its location. So on the bottom here, we've got infrared beacons, uh, and we've also got a tiny pinhole camera. And what that means is the drone can lock onto features on the ground and hold its position. So it doesn't need to know where it is in a building or in a room to hold its position so you can rotate and observe that building without worrying about the drone drifting while you're doing that. The drone has about 15 minute flight time, but it can also be moved to a certain area, uh, landed and ran as a, effectively a sentry for up to three hours off one battery charge. Um, it has a built-in microphone and it also has built-in night vision. So it can be sat at the top of a stairs or outside a building, watching a doorway uh, for up to three hours, listening uh, and watching in the dark. Another really useful thing about the Loki 2 from Sky Hero is that it has payload adapters on the base of the drone. So this model can mount uh, a range of payloads. One of the most prominent ones that we supply at the moment uh, is one from a company called Typhon, which is a distraction device. And that is a cradle which fits onto the drone, uh, which can be uh, triggered again via the controller um, to, to detonate what it calls distraction charges, uh, either one big bang or five smaller bangs, non-lethal, uh, to, to distract a target or to draw attention away towards where the drone is. The Loki 2 also has a range of security features uh, which you'd expect from a drone built for police and military use. So not only is it AES-256 encrypted, that's the link between the controller and the drone, but the video feed can also be scrambled. So what this means is even if it is intercepted, which it won't be, uh, the, the input that's getting taken from that, no one will be able to tell what that video is. It also means that the connection between the two is analog. So if for any reason you lose connection, it won't just cut out and the drone will, will, will land or crash. You'll slowly see a degradation in the quality of the connection. So you can land the drone while you've still got feed, move forwards and then carry on with your operation. So with the kit as standard, uh, you get one drone, you get a range of spares, spare, uh, spare fittings around the side and spare propellers. Uh, you get a range of batteries, which are the LiPo batteries which clip into the back of the drone. Just clip in like that. And you also get the controller. Um, we also do kits with this where you get more than one drone, uh, always up to one spare, but then also further accessories such as the distraction payloads uh, and such as additional drones. So now what we're gonna do is test one of the drones. So we're gonna take this one here and we're gonna give it a quick fly around the office. Thank you. 
So thank you for watching this video on the Sky Hero Loki 2. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if you want any more information on the drone, please click on the links below or contact me directly at sam.deniff at copters.com.